I was um, uh, a budding bird watcher. I had my first bird list when I was 12 years old. And of course, this is a wonderful migratory area. And, and so we, uh, we would walk up and down the, the, uh, the tracks. Uh, we weren't supposed to because you're not supposed to tra trespass on train tracks, but the train only came by twice a day. And um, one time, and maybe more than once, a killdeer nested, uh, laid its eggs right in the middle of the tracks. Well, a killdeer is a shorebird that um, doesn't really spend much time in water. They're sort of a terrestrial shorebird and a bird of pastures. Um, and uh, they like to nest in gravel. And uh, of course, there's very few pedestrians, no cars, only a train to worry about twice a day. And so a perfect place for the killdeer to put its, its nest. And I discovered this, this nest, which is incredibly exciting, you know, right in our backyard, a killdeer nest right in the middle of the tracks. And uh, I kept my eye on it, and then I uh, came back one day, and the eggs were gone, and uh, we did see a baby killdeer. So I, I, had the, I had an image of a baby killdeer, probably several of them. So I said, hey, I, I want to I revisit my childhood, that wonderful time back along the tracks. Um, so I had the baby killdeer way off to one side, because, again, in my composition, I don't Sometimes I believe in being front and center, just looking right, bam, between the eyes. But other times, more like Oriental art, I want to be more obscure and off to one side and, and leading, your, leading your eye around the picture. Um, so I, I put the killdeer there. Then I needed some other life in it. And this dandelion and that dandelion were growing in a flower pot in the studio where I was living in Burlington. Uh, dandelions are, are, the, are the perfect pioneers that take opportunities to pop up in stuff that man has messed up. And possibly the grass, I don't remember if the grass was in the studio or I just made it up from some grass outside in Burlington, but I know, I know the dandelions uh, leaves came from, uh, from that flower pot. And so that's how the whole thing was put together. And once again, it's essential to have everything, in my view, where it is and exactly where it is, and it would not be better if I finished it. Uh, quite a few of my favorite Andrew Wyeths, he just leaves. He said, he said all he needs to say here, and then he just stops. Why, why is it necessary to fill it in? And the same down here. And also, it kind of adds a freshness of the white of the, of the board.